What's going on you guys? My name is Krago Crystal, you can call me Krago, and you're probably wondering where, what I'm wearing around my neck. This is the Advanced Adventures Randomizer Nuzlocke, not randomized at all because I'm saying the wrong things. Why? Because uh, I'm a little brain scattered. If you guys don't know, I'm recording this on the day of June 14th. If you don't know what that is, June 14th is my birthday. I've, in the past, I did a stream. Uh, I don't know if I'm streaming tonight. You guys will tell, let me know in the comment section tomorrow on Monday when this video goes live. But what am I wearing around my neck? This was a nice gift from my family. It's called a candy wreath. It's been raining candy the entire time. I am committed to wearing this around my neck for the entirety of this video. Why? Because it's fun and random. Let's do a quick team recap because on Mondays we do team recaps. I grinded between episodes to get ready for this. I'm trying to make sure my chair doesn't get caught on anything when I scroll in, but I can't really move my neck too much without making crazy amounts of noise. But leading the squad, we've got Livewire, Electa Buzz with Thunderbolt, Quick Attack, Swift, and Light Screen. We've got Green Bean, the Salamence with Dragon Claw, Outrage, and Leaf Blade, and Fly as well. Green Bean's a Tyrant Pokemon. The rest of our Pokemon are Tyrant Pokemon. He is a Grass Dragon type. We've then got Hazmat, our Poison Psychic type Tyrant, Claydol, with Sludge Psychic Luster Purge. I switched out Luster Purge for Psycho Boost because Psycho Boost missed too often and reduced our stats, so I'd rather just have a move that I can click that's strong. And another chance to re special defense. I realize it's basically just a um, budget Psychic, but I'd rather have that. With Toxic as well. We've then got Jack Frost, our Tyrant Gengar, with the Ice Ghost typing with Shadow Ball, Ice Beam, Ice Punch, and Psychic. He finally learned Shadow Ball. The Gengar that finally learned Shadow Ball. We've then got Zabuza, our Tyrant Arcanine. His words take a second to get to my mouth. Water, Fire type with Surf, Flamethrower, Crunch, and Extreme Speed. And I think finally you've got Whisper, our Zigzagoon. He is also a Tyrant Pokemon with Steel Normal Typing with Crush Claw, Metal Claw, Meteor Mash, and Quick Attack. That is the squad. You know, I was watching a video, right? And they're saying, don't do Let's Plays if you want to be a YouTuber. Don't do, try to be unique, be, do something different. And first of all, if you're wondering why we're starting in the city, it's because I would like to collect um, the Pokemon from the buildings. And I would like to say, I'm a little disappointed. No one voted. Uh, you guys are just mean people. Luckily, what happened was the game glitched. So if I look in my bag, I'm pretty sure... Oh, I only have one. I only have one. It's for, it's colored red in decoration. Does it mean it's for the other one? I don't know. We'll find out. I, I The game glitched, so I got, a se I got a second key, but I don't know if it really is going to work. Holy macaroni! Is that what I think it... Let me see that. I was right. What is your name? Krago, is it? Well, Krago, you hold on to one of the two keys cr ever created in all of history that can open this door. Rumor has it that a legendary Pokemon whose power glows seven colors resides in this tower. Please keep in mind that once a key is used, it will be destroyed. They will be designed only to be used once. Would you like to use a key on this tower? No. They're going to explain what they are. I want to look at this now. So we got rainbow glowing Pokemon in there, which is sick sounding. And then we've got... Ooh, that's ho then, isn't it? I'm going to text... Oh, he's laugh my friend's laughing at me. I just got a new watch. Siri, screw off. Dismiss. Sick. So I'm gonna try to ignore it as much as possible. We've then got Holy Macaroni. Let me see that. Created an old history that can open it. Rumor has it. The Guardian of the Sea is Okay. So if you guys don't know, personally, I'm a ho -Oh fan. So we're gonna go ho -Oh. Let's go. But anyway, back to my rant. People keep saying, you know, if you want to be good at YouTube, and I, I agree with this, though, you need to make sure you have unique ideas. And if you're playing Poketubing especially, you need to have a don't do a Let's Play, just do something different, do something that's unique, do something that'll make you stand out. And I agree to a point. Um, I think there's a lot of issues with these kind of videos, personally. And that might be because I'm not one of those people that's huge. You know, I don't have a massive following. I don't, I don't even consider it a YouTuber. I don't consider myself a YouTuber because I don't have viewers, right? However, um, I personally believe that there's an issue with them saying, you know, you need to not make sure you don't do these things if you wanna grow. Um, and yeah, if you wanna grow on YouTube, sure, you need to stand out, And there's, but there's also a chance that your personality can also work, correct? That's one thing I've learned when I listen to things. I've got viewers. Sometimes I sometimes get viewers, and that's just because I and that's and I I'm doing this, right? But that's also because I'm weird, right? I hope 
Let me know in the comment section down below if I'm weird. By the way, Whisper is named after one of you guys. I forgot to mention this in the team recap because I haven't done a team recap in a hot minute. If you would like your name to be named after Pokemon, make sure you do comment down below. It can be anything you want. Let's say what's your favorite candy. Since we got a candy wreath here. Now, let's do this. Personally, I believe that saying like, oh, blah, blah, blah. It's so stupid that you would do this because it makes you not stand out. You can literally do whatever you want. YouTube is for fun. You do not have to upload to make sure you're famous. I'm not uploading to be famous. I like the viewers. I like having the subscriptions going up. However, that's a side note. I'm just enjoying it because it's a hobby. I have a very, very long career planned, hopefully, that is not YouTube. I love editing, I love videos, I love all that kind of stuff, so it's very nice that this is an aspect of my life that is possible if I'm lucky. However, I do not care if it doesn't pan out. That's kind of what my personal stance is. You don't have to listen to me. However, I, this is me saying, take that to the people who are like, you need to have a unique thing to stand out. I am playing a game with a freaking wooden circle with candy stuck to it around my neck. Is that unique enough for you? Let's get on to this. Crago, what's up? So that's where your second key went. Ah, you fool, you fool. Now because of you, we will never be able to access the second tower. No matter. I will make sure I catch Ho and add him to my collection. Drake, let's do this. Damn, he's just too powerful. Drake, quickly, we gotta go. Otherwise, we will be killed. We will leave Krygo as bait. See you in the next life, Krygo. So we're gonna get... By the way, we got a Jirachi from that, um... We got a Jirachi from that egg... The Jirachi, I don't think it's a, I don't think it's going to be a, a tyrant form because he hasn't messed with it. Sick, it's level 45, we can actually do this. I'm going to light screen immediately. Um, what was I going to say? Yeah, we got a Jirachi from the egg, which is insane. Like, craziness. I'm going to quick attack. This is going to take a while because the hoe is thick. Who is messaging me? This is the thing, I'm recording on my birthday, so I'm going to get a lot of mes messages. Fire blast! Yikes! That would that was a lot of damage actually. It's fine. Oh Jesus! Stop it! I would like you to use a physical move so I can so I can static you. That's the only reason why I'm doing this. So I can static you because I'm pretty sure I can one shot you with a thunderbolt. Oh Jesus Christ! Quick attack! I'm not clicking. For the record, I'm not clicking Toxic because I'm pretty sure that'll kill it for sure. But I would... Oh, it's Safeguarding. That also will be an aspect of why it's not dying. I feel like Hulk might be able to take a Thunderbolt from an Electabuzz, but I do not want to test it. We're about to run out of PP on Electabuzz. What else do I have that can status condition? Summary. Do I have Body Slam on you? No. 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 I got rid of Body Slam. Damn it. I don't... Really? Really? Nothing? I, I could Hail Mary it and see what happens. Let's light screen again. That's why I did Fire Blaster doing so much more. I feel like Ho-Oh could eat it, but maybe not at full health. I need to get this thing down on HP. Otherwise, we will get very badly messed up. I'm going to try and catch this. Okay. Recover has like 10 HP. 10 PP. So we should be fine. It should... I'm out of PP for that. That was a crit. Come on. Come on. It's still using recover. Dude. I would like to catch this thing. Okay, let's let's just try this, okay? We have we also have one timer ball. I've held on to this for a long time, which means it's plausible that I could work out pretty well for us. Jesus Christ, hello. God, dude. Okay, I'm not clicking either of these moves because he has reduced stats. Uh oh, I don't know if I can Green Bean might be able to hit him with don't kill, don't kill. Thank you. He's in the red now. Ultra Ball. Come on. Dude, are we even allowed to catch this thing? It looks like it just doesn't want us to catch it. I'm going to go through a bunch of Pokeballs, I think. And the move is to wait till we get down to, like, let's say... 
Am I getting a phone call or something? Siri, I'm not talking to you. Go away. Oh, I'll have to look at that later. Um. Okay, let's just keep checking balls at this point. Damn, dude, this is annoying. I'm sorry, there's gonna be a lot of speed up right now. We're supposed to do the gym after this, which we will, by the way. Ooh, that wobbled. <gasps> oh, yeah, flying type moves are super effective. You shouldn't be in now. We're switching. We're switching back to Zabuza. Okay, okay. Let's go back to ultra balling. Ooh, that was a bunch of wibbles. Let's see this. No. Come on. One. Okay. One. Damn. We're getting one now. One. Two. Okay, we're getting two now. One. Two. Three. We got him! And I dropped my controller. That's gonna be annoying to pick up with my this thing around my neck. I got him. I got it. I got it, guys. I was just gonna hold this thing up, but then I realized there's no point in being like, this is a candy wreath. What do we name our ho -Oh? Did I get a comment? I don't think I got any YouTube comments recently. I apologize if I... I'm missing you. Uh, I'm gonna name you Prisma. Why not Prisma? Because you're a giant... I think you're the queen of the skies. And a prism is the thing that splits the light into rainbows. I took physics. Sick. So basically, it was between ho -Oh and Lugia. Personally, I'm a ho -Oh man. He is quad weak to rocks. However, I'm not going to use him. I don't need legendaries to win this game. Just want to put that out there. How many... Speaking of which, how many hyper potions? I got 40. We're fine. Let's go heal real fast. And check out our PC box. I want to show this off. So, when we get... We got Ho-Oh, right? I just want to double check him. He's fire flying with pressure. He had fire blast, recover gust, and safeguard, which is sick. This is everything else. And look at Ula. Yes, we got Ula back from the freaking sun and moon. Randomizer Nuzlocke. She has got Confusion, Wish, and Rest. She's level 5, so yikes. I do not want to level her up right now. So that'll take forever. It took me like 45 minutes just to level up my team to level 50. Although it was a little bit more enjoyable in the Dragon's Den. Dragon's Lair, whatever you want to call it. Alright, ladies and gentlemen. It is time. It is that time of the episode. Because apparently we fight a gym every few episodes. But we're on a, a, episode 11. Who is messaging me, dude? Leave me alone. I guess I should take off the watch during recording periods, but whatever. We're fine, don't worry. This is actually making me sit up straight, because if I hunch, it hurts more. So maybe this is... I'm sorry, that was one of my bows rubbing against the shock mount. Um, okay, let's lead with Jack Frost, because I'm pretty confident in Jack Frost's ability just to punch everything we fight. So that's going to be sick. All right. Let's speed through these non-important battles. Ice punch. One shot. Ready, ready, ready. Ice punch. One shot. And, ooh, you're not a dragon. Unless they added something. Let's see. Do we have enough PP and everything? Am I confident? Yes, I am. Let's not even, let's not even question it. I feel like this is an old man. Haha, <laughs> well, hello there, Crago. I was hoping you would have made it this far. It's been a long time since I trampled on something prepared to fight me, the dragon trainer. That hurts my voice. You're a ninja. Ah, yes, the Kingdra. That one's scary, actually. Um, because he's a water dragon. So I think what we gotta do is go to live wire. Hope he doesn't do anything crazy. Live where I might die here. This is a Kingdra thing. If it if it has sniper, it's gonna do a lot. We're gonna light screen up, and then I need actually I'm gonna use live wire to kill the Kingdra. Because I don't wanna stay in with Jack Frost against a water type because those attacks will hurt so bad. You know what, live wire, if you can paralyze with this Thunderbolt, it'd be very appreciated. Okay. I don't understand why. Um, I'm see. Hold on. I don't know what's happening. I want to see if I can get my Siri. Siri, 
Hey Siri. Turn on to silent mode. Media volume set to zero percent. Sick. Now we won't I won't have to deal with that. Jack Ross is level is leveled up. Sick. Alrighty then. Flygon. I can deal with the flygon. It's hailing, which means Jack Frost is gonna be in his element, which means he can punch everyone out. I could teach him Blizzard and he would be able to wreck house even more. But uh we're good. We Gucci! Yeah, I think There's your thumbnail right there. Okay, that's gotta be a thumbnail. I'm sorry. Normally I've actually tried not to put my face on the thumbnails, which I think is a bad idea to be honest. Um but uh we are I I try not to put my face on the thumbnails for the series because I feel like when you play a GBA ROM hack, you gotta just chill and enjoy the game for what it is. Not for the person. I am not teaching you sheer cold, Jack Frost. Sick. Altaria. Oh, I eat I eat Altaria for breakfast. Dude, this watch is going insane. Bro. I swear to god. It, because of the first day, it takes a little bit for it to catch up. Also, I'm getting a lot of birthday messages. So uh, but thank you to everyone who's sending me birthday messages if you watch this. I know I think none of them watch this because no one's interested in Pokemon, which is fine! Dude, you don't have to support me. And that's not me being like facetious. I didn't look at what he was sending out. That's a Dragonair. I know I can one-shot a Dragonair. Easy. Cause I just click Ice Beam. Ice Beam will do so much. I still say my idea of having it be like um, hail and sand, all weather conditions do not impact steel types, except for rain, which will rust, so it takes damage. Big brain, Pokemon company, hook me up. I'm just saying. Here's Dragonite. Yeah, Dragonite can get a crazy moveset, though. Fire Punch. Um, that's the big one. Thunder Punch, Hyper Beam. Dead. Yeah, yeah, the move where he faints instantly. That's an option, too. Because I still have the Ice-type Gengar. Because I'm a god. And I have a Candy Wreath. That is how you win. And I got the seventh badge. Damn, that's crazy. We're that late in the game now. 40 hours. Most of those hours have been gone have gone to grinding, for the record. This town is free. I I killed the dragon. Or no, I killed the second dragon. I caught the first one. I have it in my party. Alright, let's just do this. There's usually like little side things in the city that give you Pokemon. I kinda wanna check it out. Isn't it like this house? Let's find out you. TM22. Oh, I already got that last time. Rip. Whatever. Let's move on. I didn't even need to heal, dude. No one's allowed as long as we were seventh. Is the Pokemon back there, dude? Do I have to go back and do the thing again? I do, don't I? No! Okay, so welcome to what's annoying as hell. Is that we get these little glitches that make me repeat things. So basically... I might actually have to go and redo the entire legendary Pokemon battle. I won't catch an ass I, I want to catch the second legendary, but I'm not going to. What I'm going to do is we are going to switch controls, and we're going to get a bunch of speed up right now. Um, we might turn it into just a montage while I try to get through this as fast as I can before, so we can continue on with this episode, because I want to do a little bit more stuff. We are at that point in the episode, so we are actually going to run all the way to the point where Rubish was. Uh, I beat the gem already. I don't want them to make me beat, fight the gem again because it wasn't exactly like one of those things I think I can just stomp right off the bat again. I stomped it the first time, okay? I don't think I need to stomp it twice. Oh, Max power wore off. Get more, get more, get more. Oh. This is where I grinded about right around here. I just sat in this one up and down and I was able to fight Pokemon. And hatch my egg at the same time. It's pretty great. I'm trying to get through this, guys. I'm sorry. I, it's one thing that's super annoying about this game is that it does that glitch. And I don't know if there's a fix for it. To be honest, I haven't actually taken the time to look up if there's a fix for it. Because I've been too busy trying not to lose things. Okay, I'm going to one-shot everything now. 
it's good for experience though. Look, look. 53. 54. Okay. Let's get rid of the Jolteon next. Ice Beam. Ice Beam again. Goodbye. Ice Beam. Ice Beam. Ice Punch. 54. Ice Beam. Oh, I shouldn't have stayed in on that one. I'm confused immediately. Goodbye. Noctowl. Oh, I don't remember how... It Noctowl is a little annoying. Because it's a little harder to, to, to kill. Never mind. Not as hard. Then I go like this. And we go... Ice Beam. And win. That's how you do it. Okay, the gym leader's still gone, which is good. Sick. I think we still have to do one last thing. We have to do one last thing before we move on. I do want to catch the Lugia. Because I'm pretty sure this is plot. So I have to do it. We did the Ho-Oh last time. Let's catch the Lugia. This is just going to be a legendary episode. Uh, the wrong guard turned around. Okay. Okay, this time it's Lugia. We're going to lead with live wire, I think. Lugia's flying water, right? Or flying psychic, which means... Zabuza is probably the better option. Let's just do this. Fly through it. Blah, blah, blah. We know this dialogue. Okay. Come on, Lugia. Let's go. Light screen. Hydro eaten. Swift. 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 Now, ready? First ball. First ball. Look at this. I'm so good at catching legend. Nope. Oh, he also has recover. Swift. 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 Listen, if it takes too long, I'm just gonna kill him. Lugia. I, I'm personally not a Lugia fan. How much does this do? Listen, Lugia. I'm not feeling this, okay? You're being really annoying. Technically, you're not even supposed to be here. My question is, game, why is it that Lugia isn't a flying water type? That's how he should be. Damn, this man's still not getting caught. One. Okay, we're getting close. Come on. Let's see this. Dude! Okay, this is... Oh, it's getting lower. I'm gonna let him... I'm gonna let him recover up a little bit more because I don't actually want to kill him right now. Okay, there we go. Let's go get another one. Come on, Lugia. If I get to 10, I will check the timer ball. Come on. Come on, three more. Holy crap, dude. No. He recovered. I almost killed him. Quick attack spam. Thunderbolt. Quick attack spam a little bit. Okay, we're thunderbolting him down to half. Again, I crit. Okay, cool. Don't care that much, to be honest. Lugia's dealt with. Let's go and progress a little bit. Because we've been in the same town. We're going towards the last gym now. We're coming towards the end of this. Let's talk to you. Krago, you truly are a hero. Please go forth and take down Rubish. Take this as token appreciation. TMO2. Isn't that Dragonclaw? Or is it TMO1? No, it's Dragonclaw. No one can learn it. Sick. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Nope, not happening. Sableye? Ooh, you got a weird team, dude. Little 52s as well. Damn. It's actually a very interesting route structure. It's actually a very interesting route structure, dude. Thunderbolt. Let's just flamethrower the Murkrow. Murkrow can't evolve in this gen. So it doesn't really matter. 18 grand, dude. That's, like, that's, n that's crazy money. Okay, looks like there's a lot to do here, actually. We took a bunch of time because of the glitch, which makes me a little sad. But I think we're gonna have to just chill right now and come back and do it next episode on Wednesday. By the way, when is this going up? This is going up on the 15th. On Wednesday, 
when this video goes live, there should be the Isle of Armor expansion live. I don't know when it releases. However, what's going to happen is we are going to stream. I'm probably going to try to stream the entire expansion in one day. I don't think it's going to be super, super long. We'll find out. It's going to be fun. Come check that out. It's going to be super fun. Let's move on to the wrap-up of this video. If you did enjoy, click the like button down below. It does support the channel and the series a lot. Don't be afraid to subscribe to the Crystal Crew. We're always welcoming more mem members. And if you would like to go above and beyond, make sure you share the video with your friends, family, cats, ornaments, whatever you want. That will help the channel grow, help the video grow as well. And as always, guys, I will see you, you, and you in the next video. See you then, guys.